As you can see, we are now featuring the dual joystick controls in this machine. Now one of the first things you'll notice as we look at these controls, as I put my hand onto the controls, you'll see my arm and hand are in a very comfortable and natural state on these controls. Now we'd like to spend just a few minutes and talk about the controls on each side. As we look at this right side control, you'll see that by raising and lowering the control fore and aft, I can raise and lower the mow board on this machine. Now if I take this control side to side, as you can see, that is my blade side shift on this tractor. Now as you look at these controls, you'll notice that we are using rollers to move some of the, some of the implements on this machine. The reason we've gone to rollers, this allows us to have metering and very smooth operations as we operate the motor grader during the day. Now as we look at my right hand, using my finger, I can activate, for example, with this roller wheel, I can activate my circle side shift, right and left. The second roller you can see that I would, I would access with my finger would be able to manipulate, for example, a front or mid-mount scarifier, or maybe the, the front plow if I'm moving snow. Now the other two rollers you can see that I'm going to access with my thumb, the bottom one allows me to move my wheel lean right and left. The next control wheel allows me to actually move my articulation on this tractor. Now we've set it in this position because you'll notice the button here. This is actually my return to straight button on my articulation. It makes it very simple to operate this function. Now the other button located on the front is to turn on and off my manual switch for differential lock. Now this tractor still comes available with the automatic differential lock so I can run manually or utilize my automatic diff lock on this machine. Now you'll also notice we have another button located right here that would be able to be manipulated also with the joint on your thumb and this is saved for future features that will come on the motor grader. Now the last thing we want to look at is you'll notice that we have roller wheels available for our auxiliary functions. For example, if we are uh, going to utilize a snow wing, they are also the roller control, again allows us the ability to meter and be very smooth in the movement of these functions on the tractor.